Hi, my beautiful Pisces. Welcome to my channel, Goddess of Light 1111. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are returning subscribers, welcome back. This reading is for my lovely Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Thank you, God. Thank you, Universe, Universal Energies, Ancestors, Spirit Guide, Archangels, Ascended Masters. Please give my lovely Pisces a clear, precise, honest message for the highest good. All right, Pisces, if you are new to my channel, you've got to hit the like, the subscribe button, the notification bell below. If you are returning subscribers, welcome back. I do appreciate each and every one of you that are supporting my channel. I'm grateful and thankful. I'm sending lots of love, no beginning, and prosperity your way. Energies are fluid. This reading may or may not resonate with you. If it's not resonate, please check out your order of chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonate and leave the rest. So Pisces, I'm sending you guys... <clears throat> lots of love love and light and healing energy towards all of you my beautiful Piscean alright so let's see what's going on for you Pisces we have treasure island so uh, what I'm hearing you know slow and steady when the race and there's a need for you Pisces to be patient for something here because we have treasure island and we have go to the distance for some of you i felt like you know uh, i'm hearing whatever it takes i felt like someone treasure you and you guys might not even know that that's what i'm hearing here with the treasure island slow and steady wonder ways it's like the star is aligned for you perfectly Holy Spirit, Ancestors, what do you have for my lovely Pisces? You have blessed. Beautiful. I felt like, you know, I'm here and count your blessing, number 22, 22, or 4. Um, but 2 is about balance. So there's a need for you to meditate, pray, bring balance, you know, come down to this earth. You know, because I feel like once you come down to this earth, you know, you will blessing with abundant love. That's what I'm hearing. I'm definitely getting like, you know, let love, let love flow to you. Let, you know, you'll be blessed. So some type of no love is coming for you. That's nice. Give me one more. Give me one card, please, for the person Pisces may be dealing with. Or if you're not dealing with anyone for that matter. I feel like for some of you Pisces, you get some type of chewed. Um, or I say, yeah, someone with, we, uh, someone, um, will move a mess. Number 14 is a five that's been change in a situation that's been change in love. I feel like no love. Yeah. Someone here, there's love coming to it. Someone, someone could be doing self love here, which should be told. We move a blindfold, we move a mask here. That's, you know, bringing that's going to bring love like i said you guys getting some type of no love we are between wall at the bottom <coughs> excuse me guys so there's love coming for you guys you might not even know that no love too you gotta bless with some type of beautiful love here lots of lots of love <laughs> Holy Spirit, and so, so may I have two cards, please, for the person Pisces may or may not deal with. So we have, we both know I'm not the one for you. Well, ouch. Yeah, for those of you that are dealing with an ex, you know, that have an ex in your energy. Yeah, this ex, this ex, no, they are not the one for you. So this is good. We will be together again. So you guys, this person could be a twin flame you guys are dealing with. I feel like um, for some of you, <laughs> this is what I'm getting here. Some of you are dealing with your twin flame. You are not in a relationship with your twin flame here. We both know I'm not the one for you. So this person know at this time you guys are not to be together, but you will be together again, you know, maybe in the next life. Wow, this is, this is deep. Give me two cards, please, for Pisces. I am grateful for the spiritual lesson. I felt like, you know, uh, some of you learning some type of lesson. This is nice. Give me one more card for Pisces, please.
Oh, you guys are definitely not wearing this flow in the reverse. It's to go all the way with it just so it can be in the reverse. Someone is like, I am waiting on you. I am not waiting. So you guys are not waiting for a side from this person. You guys know You guys know someone is not going to contact you. They're not going to send you any type of messages here. Whatever this is, you know, you guys know that a situation between you and your twin is done. It's time for me to heal now. Yes. You see, it's time for me to heal now. Mm -hmm. It's either for you or them. It's time for you guys to heal because this uh, situation, a cycle is closed between you and someone else. So we'll see. Hopefully there's no love for you, for some of you Pisces. So, you know, you deserve love to come out. So someone in here, is spirit is telling them that you are lovable. You deserve love. So I feel like no love is coming for somebody here. May I have one card, please, for Pisces, Holy Spirit, Ancestors? There's definitely no love coming for somebody here. Give me one card, please, for Pisces. We have separation. So you guys might be currently going to some type of separation with somebody here. Give me, may I please have one card, please, for the person Pisces may you are dealing with? Yeah, someone is attracted to you. This person could be very, very attractive. Or like, like people find this person very attractive. That's the energy that I'm getting, whomever you are dealing with. Time apart from your horizon is... Um, it's in the horizon here. We have getting to know each other. So like I say, yeah, there's no love coming uh, for you guys here. And you might not even see that. Holy Spirit, ancestors, may I have three cards, please, for my beautiful Piscean. We have Eight of Pentacles. We have this strength card. You guys might be working together. Maybe you guys are working in your in your uh, try to work in your marriage here, but there's a need for you to to be strong, especially if you guys you know you guys are trying going to some type of separation, but you want to fight for this relationship. There's something here, especially collaboration, that you need to be strong. You need to hold together because I'm getting here for some of you Pisces. Maybe you judge somebody wrong. You make a wrong judgment call here with the justice and the reverse. Oh, ouch. Someone could have also judged you wrong. May I have three cards, please, for the person Pisces is dealing with Holy Spirit ancestors? You have the sun in the reverse. Yeah, we have like, okay. Someone in here could have been feeling like some type of confusion. We have, you know, there could have been some type of confusion that's making someone feeling left out on the cold here. But I feel like this is done. The way this, these two cards come out, like if someone was getting some type of confusion here, five of pentacles, the way they come out and stuff like that, I feel like this is some, a situation that is over. Someone no longer in the five of pentacles, um, also no longer in the, yeah, something is, is done here. Queen of pentacles upright. And we have, you know, the sun here. So the sun come out in the reverse. You know, there's some type of ending here with the sun. We have the death card. Wow. Yeah, there's a cycle that's ended. Whatever this cycle here that's ended is going to bring, you know, um, a new beginning here with the death card in the world. Yeah, something is end, end, end. Like, this is what I'm getting here. So let's clarify for the person you are dealing first, Pisces. Clarify this sun in the reverse. We have the devil in the reverse. Yeah, someone in here could have been tried to, someone in here could have manipulated a situation here. What is the devil in the reverse? Seven of swords. 
I feel like somebody here is releasing some type of toxicity with the seven of swords. Someone is releasing the devil energy here with the sun and the reverse. And we have the seven of swords here. There could be some type of sneakiness and lying. Someone, I feel like somebody here could have been lying. What is the seven of swords here? Three of swords. That's bring some type of heartbreaks. What is the three of swords, please? Yeah, we have eight of swords that's coming as a challenge. Someone is here is getting out of their head from a situation here. Because what we have here is the devil in the reverse. You know, I don't know, for some of you, you could have been dealing, maybe this is your child. Someone in here kind of toxic that, you know, I'm getting in here um, with the devil. The son in the reverse, someone could have lost a child, something like that, you know. But I'm getting here, someone is, you know, a challenge is to get out of their head here. Because I feel like with the seven of swords, it's like someone lying just to make someone have some type of hard work here. So they can be stuck in their head. Or maybe that lying here. Someone could be lying about a child also. What is the eight of swords as a challenge? Wow. A freaking emperor whomever the emperor here someone here lies just to make someone be in their head because the piss what is the queen of principles we have four of cups so the queen of pentacles is you know this person could be feeling some type toys virgo capricorn someone in here feeling like um, they miss an opportunity with you. Why is the uh, Queen of Pentacles, Four of Cups? Judgment. Because someone in here feel like they didn't get judgment in this situation here. What is the judgment sideways for the... They miss some type of opportunity with you. Yeah, three of wands. They have to move on. This person is moving forward here. What is the three of wands? Three of pentacles. So there's two threes here. Someone is moving forward here. Focus on their work here. What is the three of pentacles? Someone, someone is uh, living in some type of collaborative something here behind. And there could be some type of regret, feeling some type of remorse here. What is the seven of, uh, I don't know who you guys are working with, but this is sound like a little bit complicated. So what is the seven of cups in the reverse? Two of cups. Someone in here in a love, I feel like someone in here, this person don't, someone in here want giving and receiving love with you, but what they don't want to deal, they don't want to deal with toxicity, they don't want to, uh, they don't want to be in options, but this person loves you. What is the two of cups? Nine of wands. Yeah, someone like, okay, I, I love you. I want to be with you, but I don't want to be, you know, someone he's standing their ground because they don't want to be in a toxic relationship. They want, they don't want to do third party. Clarify the Knight of Wands here, please. Is this person standing their ground. Yeah, Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So someone decided to stand in their ground here. I felt like also someone did, someone felt like this is a missed opportunity because someone regret. Someone here, it could be an earth sign, you know, Taurus Virgo Capricorn, someone will regret, like, you know, working together with three of pentacles here. They kind of regret about this. They're feeling regretful, remorseful here. Yeah, someone like, no, I'm not doing any type of toxic relationship here. And they stand their ground, protect their energy. What's the Queen of Wands here? It was Leo Sagittarius. Yeah, and this person moved on because they didn't want they, because someone he didn't want to do toxic relationship. What is the five of pentacles in the reverse? Yeah, someone he tell the truth, Pisces. You someone he could have been tell the truth, but you guys don't believe this person. What is the ace of swords? Yeah, six of wands. This person tell the truth about some type of getting attention. What is the six of wands? about eight of wands about some type of fast communication here so this person being honest 
Wow, what is the Eight of Wands? This is crazy. Three of Cups. Yeah, I bought some type of celebration. I bought some type of maybe celebration regarding birthday, regarding baby shower, you know, engagement. Something in here, this person, somebody tell the truth. They walk away because they didn't want to be in a third party. They didn't want to be nobody options. But somebody here was working with an earth sign because they want some type of karma to happen to somebody. And I feel like the emperor here, whoever this emperor could be, ex has been a control freak that want things their way. We have King of Wands at the bottom, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So this person, someone he gets some type of clarity. King of Pentacles, Two of Wands. Somebody was trying to make someone to move forward so they can betray somebody here. Like somebody wanted somebody to take action so they can betray somebody. But, you know, with the Ten of Swords, you're telling me this is a, something that happened in the past. Well, let me see how short can I make this? Two minutes. <laughs> what is the uh, justice in the reverse for Pisces? Yeah, because you guys didn't get some type of justice here. You felt like something is unjust because you have to move towards common water. What is Six of Swords? Yeah, Seven of Pentacles. Because... For maybe Pisces, you know, I'm just going to tell you whom, whether you or somebody here invested of someone getting some type of karma, but you know, this is all based on lies, based on manipulation here, because the emperor is a manipulative person, because I feel like someone felt like they invest in this situation, seven of pentacles, and they didn't get things their way, yeah. Two of Cups, a fake oh, fake love offer. Someone in here could have been, you know, I felt like someone in here was invested in giving someone a false offer and things didn't turn out. They didn't get that. They didn't get the satisfaction here with the Two of Cups. Give me one more card, please, for the Two of Cups. Yeah, Ten of Wands. The situation become a burden with the Ten of Wands here because someone in here like, nah, I'm good. What is the strength card, please, for Pisces? Yeah, five of cups. Again, there's the five of cups again. Some of you could have been, you know, maybe there's a Leo involved here with the strength card. Someone feeling bad, someone feeling regretful, remorseful here. What is the five of cups? Queen of Pentacles. Wow. Whomever you, you guys definitely maybe could have been working with this Queen of Pentacles. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. What is the Queen of Pentacles here for Pisces? This person is grounded though. Two of Wands. Someone in here was hoping this this two was this. Someone in here was hoping this earth sign take action, moving forward. What action? What is the two of wands? Yeah, a Sagittarius. You know, it could be a Sagittarius or Leo that was hoping someone move forward here so they can trap this person so they can cut this person nine of wands he king of wands i feel like things could have backfire here because whomever this person here whomever the queen of pentacles they hold their ground here they stand in the ground they stand in the power protect themselves king of wands here it was leo sagittarius so you guys could have been working with a few people here with the eight of pentacles what is the eight of pentacles wow yeah two of pentacles yeah, some you got it felt like you guys could have been working with other people here to bring some type of unbalance on someone's work. What is the two of pentacles? Yeah, to bring to make someone money be unbalanced. Wow. What is the king of wands here for Pisces? Yeah, look at that. This fake angel here this person is unbalanced this is a sagittarius to be specific so you guys could have been trying to work in. this is what it say here this is someone you have been separated with that's look like to me wow so this is all about money So what it looked like 
like the table I've turned, whomever that's tried to causing harm on somebody here, it backfired. So it's kind of like the player get played. That's what I'm getting here. That's the energy. Why is this uh, 10 points is sideways? Yeah, because someone felt like this is their wish fulfillment. Whomever this Sagittarius here, whatever this person who had been planning, they felt like that, that was their wish fulfillment here to get what is the Nine of Cups. Yeah. Someone is standing their power here, whomever this is. So we have all this sign here. We have King of Cups. There's a lot of people here. Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands, King of Wands, King of Cups, the Emperor, Queen of Pentacles is here, repeated themselves. Wow. Mm. So the King of Cups. The King of Cups here, Ten of Pentacles. This is about money or family. But I felt like whatever that happened here, someone is getting their karma. This is about the past. The tower happened with the Wheel of Fortune here. I felt like someone in here, something that happened, whatever this is, is done with. So guys, let's get some, let me get some advice for you Pisces. Mm. What is the advice you have for Pisces, please? We have divine timing. So if you expect to be with somebody, whatever divine timing here, it could be karma, it could be reunited with somebody here, but whatever this is here, I feel like the universe is working on you. Give me one card, please, for the person um, Pisces is dealing with. Right. Let the past be the past. Yeah, someone here surrendered to the divine, grounded the energy, all this card. Because someone decided to part with God here. This person could be an earth angel, surrender. They are surrendered to the divine. Yeah. And someone in here is angelically protected by God, by the angels. Wow. All right, Pisces. I love you guys. Bye.